Okay, class. Uh, okay, basically what we're going to be talking about today uh, is subduction zones okay, and how they lead to the creation of aquifers. Okay. Okay, well, today we're going to go and go and, and going and go and, and go and um, and talk about the uh, the oh, 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 oh genesis in the oh, 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 oh site. The biggest trench actually is the uh, the Mariana Trench, okay, which if you can look in the map back in the room, okay, is you're gonna see that there's a big trench, okay, and it goes down all the way. And uh, in human life, I mean it's not impossible down there, you have to go down to the submarine. Yeah. Is possible to go down to the Titanic basically on Titanic? Oh no no, I don't I don't think you can go down to the Titanic, but it's it's like a mile and a half down the North Atlantic. It's very, very, very tough to go down there. I mean, you have to go down there suddenly, but... Now, we're going to go on and go on and going and go and go uh, and talk about the diagram. Here's the diagram. Okay, you got it? Okay. Now, we're going to go and go and, and going and go on and do the, do the lab on the, uh, the Oga... O, o, Oh, Oga, Oga Lala Aquifer. And then, I told you bud. Oh, bud, wake like up. Okay, so your quiz tomorrow is going to have uh, 15 words. I need you to cop down, copy down all 75 of them, okay? And uh, turn it in by tomorrow, okay? And there's going to go and be no playing around in the laboratory. Or I'm going to go and go and, and, and go and, and go and, and, and go and, and send you to the principal's office. And go. Class is dismissed, all right? So you all can go on ahead out. Okay, bud. No, all right, bud. <laughs> yeah, yeah, you kind of, you kind of hit some points there. You know, you know, we we have these things where we want to make make moral decisions. Like, what was that one? Uh, that one, that one question. I put it on a quiz. It's about like if a gorilla steals a cheeseburger from uh, from a young child. How does that? How does it differ from when, as if a human took the, the cheeseburger of a young child? What was that again, Sulcher? Yeah, yeah, I mean, that's, that won't earn you any participation points because that was a really weak answer. <laughs> it's just like, you have morality. <laughs> And I know my handwriting is a little bad, but just, uh, just go ahead and try to take those notes down. I don't want you typing those notes on Moodle or because I know that y'all are really bad with the iPad. Anyways, <laughs> 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 uh, class, I uh, hope you enjoyed today's lecture. Uh, I'll be here all week. And, uh, you know, tip your waitresses, and I'll see y'all tomorrow. All right? <laughs> you meet me outside of class, you can uh, call me... G money. So if I if I know things about God like uh, God is big, God loves us, that's a very knowledge. But conocer knowledge is more about knowing God, having a relationship with Him. Yes. Uh, no, has to do a lot with theology. Uh, what's your iPad? Any questions over the corrections that were due last night? Uh, yes. We had, sorry, my pencil just refuses to quit. Uh, yes, the corrections that were due yesterday. Half credit back. Yeah. Um, yesterday. They were due yesterday. Okay, thank you. Thank you, class. Alright, so, uh, this is all going to be on the test, so you're going to need to know this. Alright, so, uh, Ian, what is the slope intercept form? No. Nope. That's embarrassing. My mic fell out. Wise guy, I don't need that time from you. I went to Dartmouth College. Well, you know, it's a hard college to get into. <laughs> okay. The test, the upcoming test, it will be Thursday. It will be over the chapter. Uh, yes, Colton in the back. Can you explain all of chapter 6 again? 
you know, all the all of my lecture notes are on my website, shewalking.weebly.com. Uh, that's also my nickname for all you. Uh, that's my mixtape on uh, SoundCloud, Jaywalk. <laughs> when you see this box, what it's gonna what's gonna happen is is that let's say someone puts a pinprick in that box, and the light is shining down, and you're gonna have one stream of light that's gonna be coming in, but the rest is darkness. And then when you ha when you find the rest of the darkness. You're going to find that everything flows in harmony. That there's just this one linear stream of light. <laughs> then someone adds another pin, and then another, and then another. And you have all these multiple streams of light. Well, this is like what we can say of the Word of God. That God's Word, in the Bible, especially in the New Testament, is God's revelation to us. And that's what, uh, oh, I won't think of that example because now I'm taking about uh, two hours to explain. <laughs> what you want to understand is, is that God's always been here before time and after time and for eternity. But uh, when it comes to prayer, you feel God's presence inside of you. Now, if you ever want to see me turn red in the face and get mad or infuriated, you would interrupt the prayer. And that's just basically... Uh, Basically what I wanted to cover today. <laughs> um, good morning, uh, Straight Jesuit College Preparatory. My name is uh, Mr. Brandon Love. I'm the uh, Retreat and uh, Leadership Director at Straight Jesuit. Um, today for our peer ministry class, we're going to be uh, watching this uh, movie on, on SJ. Um, I hope uh, y'all enjoy it. Uh, give me a moment. Um, uh, Father Father Bravo, um, uh, Father Bravo, the, the audio is not, um, oh, okay, thanks Father Bravo. <laughs> um, also, be before we all uh, watch the movie, um, make sure to read uh, chapters 8 through uh, 15 in your uh, uh, Youth of Catholic Youth Ministry book. Um, it talks about uh, justice and, uh, and uh, bringing uh, Jesus to, uh, to, to the youth. Uh, uh, any, any questions? Uh, yeah, they're good. Uh, all right, uh, Father Father Bravo, can you uh, can you, can you stop the video? <laughs> that was good. <laughs> So class, as we see here, y equals mx plus b is the slope of the line. Does everybody understand? Hector, son, you should be taking notes by now. Stop doing whatever you're doing, okay? Okay. Now let's continue here. So as we see, m is the coefficient, and this is the slope, and then the slope is x. Are we all paying attention, class? No, Ellie, son. Get your iPad off your desk and stop playing games, son. How many times have I told you? This happens every day. My goodness. Alright, quiz. Who invented HTML? Tim Berners-Lee? Or Blaise Pascal? Mr. Bolado? Tim Berners-Lee? That's wrong! Ah! True. No, gotcha, Boolean, baby. <laughs> All right. Now, I'm gonna take our test. We can't take it in here because you all cheat off each other. Now, I want to tell you, you can jack up my car, you can foreclose on my house. The one thing you can never take from me is my integrity. There's no teacher, coach. A Girl Scout in this world who can tell you to do anything better than your best. So do it, all right? Now, target room, 826. Stealth operation, Navy SEALs, you get me? No talking, all right? And hey, if anyone asks you, how was the quiz? You tell them, interesting and riveting, baby. Booyah! Good morning, how are you, how are you doing? All right. Okay. Um, um, okay, so this is your senior reflection uh, meeting, okay? Uh, it says here that your 
your paper hasn't been turned in yet, you know you're going to get a, an incomplete for the semester if you don't turn in that paper. Now, now, now let me tell you a story. My father told me this story. His father told him this story. Okay? Now, every morning in Africa, a gazelle wakes up. It knows it must outrun the fastest lion, or it will be killed. Every morning in Africa, a lion wakes up. It knows it must run faster than the slowest gazelle, or it will starve. It doesn't matter whether you're a lion or a gazelle. When the sun comes up, you'd better be running. Now, what do you want to be? A lion or a gazelle? It doesn't matter, you've got to be running. Now, I want you to close your eyes and think about all the service you did. Think, think hard about those people that you're helping. Now let me ask you a couple of questions. Who should I start a goalkeeper on this weekend's game? <laughs> I'm, I'm, I'm not quite sure. Should I, should I do Colin Connor or Nolan Walker? You know, Colin's a little beefier. He's a little beefier and got stronger. But, but Nolan's, Nolan's more, a little bit uh, athletic, you know? He's got a little more agility. We've got Messi. Xavi, Iniesta, all those guys. I love watching Barcelona play. It makes me happy. <laughs> and of course, Joe, Joe Wager up top. But, you know, Joe, he's been doing these impersonations of me, and I just don't think they're very good. You know, this is the last time I'm going to let him do it. The last time. After, after this, I'm, I'm, I'm never going to let him, let him do these impersonations again. So, I'm, do I'm done. <laughs> That was very good. Yeah, it was.